welcome back to Let's Play A Boy and His Blob. I'm Burning Dog Face, and last time we got this globe in that machine. And we got this flower up here to sprout, which is a very strange way of saying that we got all the remaining treasure chests in World 3, Blobalonia. Shout out to K.O.R. He left a comment correcting me in that, uh... Well, you remember the, the, the suggested flavors for the shield jelly bean? Apparently, it's not actually pronounced sherbet. Not quite as fancy as that. It's pronounced sherbet. Also clarifies that it's a sort of fizzy powder sometimes sucked through a licorice straw. Which is interesting, because I thought it was a uh, kind of ice cream. That is the wrong thing to interact with. Now we're going to head back to the Citadel to see if there's any treasure chests there, and also to see what we earned for beating the uh, the Emperor's level. I think I got all the pieces there. I'd be really annoyed if I didn't. No, no, nothing. Oh no, that's right, we came back here and it finished off the window. Yeah, I forgot about that. Okay, I did miss one treasure chest here, so I might as well go for that. Hmm, how do I know about the... Oh, right! The achievements! Let's see... Citadel, Citadel... Okay, sorry about that. Uh, the short answer is that I got the achievements for getting the, uh, all the blobs in levels 2, 3, 5, and 7. But there was only an extra achievement for level 6. That's the one where I'm missing a single blob. So I guess there aren't any dudes in 1 or 8. 1 makes sense, because that was the level with, uh, where uh, Blobbert got blobnapped. And I guess 8 also makes sense, because it was the uh, Emperor's personal stronghold. Oh no! Was I even armed with the knowledge of the colored sparks at this point? Yeah, that is absolutely a must-have. Uh, for fucks, uh, really? There. Oh, I forgot one. I just realized. Okay. Shout out to KOR again who pointed out something that had been right in front of me that I just couldn't grasp, which is that the reason they call this one the Mint Double is because of Double Mint brand chewing gum. Her, her, her. Alright, let me just, uh, set the phone down since I had been looking at that, and... missing one. So it's not ideal. I love that those aren't stalactites, by the way, or weird plants. Those are just drills. Those are designed to fall on anyone who walks underneath them. Except that guy, he's cool. Yeah! Two heads are better than one! That might be what inspired that title. Wait. Rather than crushing him to death. No. This way. There we go. Ah. Nice and quick. Oh, 
Oh, wait. Ha! Huh. I just realized what I did there. Ha ha ha! How embarrassing. No, I needed it for up there. A tight squeeze, we can handle this. I mean, if anybody can handle compression, it's the guy without bones, am I right? Yes, I remember this. Oh no. I don't remember that. I'm pretty sure that wasn't supposed to happen. Come on, get out of the way. Negotiable. It's the entire reason we're here. Fuck. They don't give you the Bananville in this level. But was that KOR again? No, it was Torek00 who said, I believe it's pronounced Bananville. Shout out. Oh! See that background element I thought was more floor. How the fuck am I meant to make that happen? It is putting me here. button alone. There we go. Well, there it is! There's a good placement for it. 
I'm actually kind of annoyed at how much easier this was, this became once I realized the truth about those fireflies. Because I don't remember even seeing them before I got to Blobolonia. Just regular ones. Close enough, buddy. Well done. That might be the very last one. Oh, for fuck's sake. Really? That's just rude. Calm down. Did that not work? Why the fuck did it? Why did the teleporter put me further back than death? you to rely on learning uh, the mint double. Oh, right. Forgot about that. I just wanted to see if it, uh, Blob Illy touching the guy would, like, splatter him. See if this will load that guy. This way. No, it is just the round one, so that's very esoteric. I'm supposed to remember that. Much less think of it as a solution to any puzzles. Yes, that's not a one-use kind of thing. I knew that. Huh, how'd that one get back up there? That's weird. I remember this and an episode here. Oh, right. Didn't think that one through. 
Crap, that only works if I'm not moving that direction. I can't tell him to stay. kinds of video games, that's what I have to admit. I am gonna miss that hug button when I play anything else after this. straightforward way. You win. Fire in the hole. they go over the edge, but the giant blocks don't. Oops. Oh, right! That's where the three, uh, the, uh, the treasure chest was. I remember that one. That's the one where the, uh... The animation actually did play out. It just wasn't playing out at a part where I thought he could reach it. And also, he was, like, three feet to the right, so... I think it was KOR who drew uh, my attention to that fact. I did take a note somewhere. It was KOR, so shout out. But, uh, on the subject of shoutouts, shout out to Rachel Starwin, who says, Hey guys, it's time for another unsolicited kitten update. Binks is officially over one pound. He will be returned to the shelter to be adopted at two pounds. So he's halfway there. Good on him. Could have just gone down the middle with the, uh, the bouncer. I just want to make sure there's nothing interesting over there. That is not right. this the first time. Yeah. 
Shit. Man, that looked good, but that was uh, mostly luck, I'll be perfectly frank with you guys. Yeah. Oh no, I left him as a cannon. Uh, sorry, Blubbert. I wasn't thinking. There it is. The last treasure chest. Oh yeah, the computer thing. It's not a computer, it's like a museum display of just a gear. We can't actually get in there, that's the one we can't do that in. Yep, yeah, there it is. Well, in between episodes, I'm going to make sure that I uh, wasn't wrong about there being no chests left in the other realms, and then I guess we'll uh, head back to square one and check out more of those challenge levels. You know, since there's more to do, after all. I would absolutely think I was done right now if I hadn't read the manual from the fucking Wii version. So yes, I would say that... If you recommend this game to someone, tell them about the colored uh, fireflies, and tell them about the challenge. Sorry, that's just really irritating to me that there is no reason that had to be that way. They could have just mentioned it, had a fucking text pop up or something. Ah, I don't know. I just really like this game, and it's and to have flaws that glaring is really, I don't know. It does not spark joy, I believe the modern phrasing is. But, that does. So I am willing to overlook that. So, I'm Burning Dogface, and I'll see you next time on Let's Play a Boy and His Blob when we head back to the treehouse. Till then, have yourselves a great day, Burning Dog fans. Later!